Look at this guy throwing an aluminum nail at a magnet. Instead of falling straight down, it slides down slowly. The same thing happened when an aluminum plate was thrown. It descended gradually, as if something was holding it back. Could this phenomenon save lives if an elevator were to fall uncontrollably? To understand this, let's first consider a small experiment. Take a copper pipe, stand it upright, and drop a small magnet through it. You'll notice the magnet falls very slowly almost as if it's floating in the air. Why does this happen? As the magnet falls, it changes the magnetic flux inside the copper pipe. This induces an electric current in the pipe, which in turn creates a magnetic field that opposes the magnet's motion. This is known as Lenz's law. Now back to the main question. Can this stop a multi-ton elevator? The answer is no. To slow down a multi-ton elevator using eddy currents, you'd need massive magnets and rails, which would generate so much heat that the rails would glow red hot and the structure might even melt. A typical elevator shaft doesn't have the space for such a setup, nor could it withstand the heat. However, eddy current braking is no gimmick. It's actually used in roller coasters. When the coaster makes its final stop, a metal plate on the car passes through a row of magnets, bringing it to a smooth stop without contact or friction. 